What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Monday morning, me and Dino heading off to a new job, Plumpton, Caroline Springs area. Dino got his license on Friday, but we just require one car at the moment. So we're heading off there this morning. We're gonna load up a new job. So drop a comment down below. Give a bit of love to Dino. We're gonna bring out a few videos this week. We've got a bit on at the moment still. So um, hope you enjoy guys. Cheers. We're going to release a couple of uh, merch items. I don't know, won't be selling for too too, um, too expensive. We're going to bring out a couple of uh, jumpers and a few uh, Hendo's bricklaying t-shirts. Let me know what you think. I'm sure you guys over in the UK could do with a nice woolly warm one. So let me know and um, and yeah, that's something on the cards that we can bring out soon. I've just arrived on site here in um, Plumpton is the nastiest sight I've ever seen. Look at this. Oh no, 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 no. With a floor in much of an angle. Jesus, nice and muddy. A brick pallet that's balancing on a crate. Oh, have a look at all these bricks. Look at the, all these bricks here. All inside the garage. Couldn't get much tighter. Have a look at this side. Complete overhand. Look at this. Got a little courtyard here. Which will be fun, at least we can lay some bricks out there to the roof. Ah, like a bit, request a bit extra for this one. Nasty. All right. Let's get the brick grubs out. We're in the process of stacking bricks in sixes, and then one of us comes in with the two brick catches in our hand. I'm loading the job by this. It's gonna be a slow process, but, um, oh, been caught. Gonna be a slow process, but uh, we'll get there. I don't think there's any easy way to do it. Plumpton Way, Caroline Springs, also leads out to Mount Atkinson out that way. There's a heap of work on for the next couple of years here, so if you are considering coming down to Melbourne to lay bricks, you will get a job. Alright, so, I've been asked which trowel I use and what I'm using at the moment. And as you can see, this is just a couple of my big collection that I have at home. This is the Foo Trowel, first off, from home, the Trojan. Obviously, one of the very first ones I ever got in my apprenticeship that I've kept this whole time. It's not in great shape. Starting off, you want something really cheap. Trojan trout from Bunnies. It's my very first one. The Ox, this is a bit bigger, 12 inch, which was pretty comfortable. I actually like using the Ox, just because of its rubber underneath the, um, the handle here. And it fits nicely in the in your, in your pointer finger. Obviously, you can't be a professional bricklayer if you don't have a Marshalltown. And that's what I've been using. Um, Marshalltown trowels for Probably the last four or five years when I really started laying bricks. That's what everyone uses. They are reliable, they feel comfortable. Although, that is not the one that I'm using at the moment. So what have I been using? I've had a couple of comments. Um, 
in my past videos ask me what trail I've got there and ones that people haven't seen before it is the Marco Pro I don't know if you've heard about that but I um I came across these at where I pick up my my cement in um in Werribee they had some for sale for like thirty dollars as you can see it's sort of like a a cheaper um, Marshalltown trail sort of the same color same same sort of uh, shape as well it's got a bit of flex that you can see as well in it like that similar to the Marshalltown and I just find that it's a bit thinner in the blade as well it sits exactly like the Marshalltown trail in my hand it feels really comfortable but it's half the price so the Marshalltowns were like 95 or something like that ridiculous in Bunnings I know you can buy them probably cheaper going straight directly but this was $39 from um, from All Green Nursery where I where I go pick up my, my cement. So I just decided I'd try them out. Got the boys a couple of new trousers each and um, I haven't looked back to be honest. It sits perfectly, like I said, it's comfortable. It's, it's the right balance in the hand. It's very, very similar to the Marco Town. So if you haven't already tried, try the Marco Pro trousers. That's what I'm using. That's my weapon of choice at the moment.